Hello there friends, I hope that you're doing well. So how to use Razer Naga Hex V2 with Razer Synapse? Uh, this mouse is not uh, that new. I think it was released uh, about five or six years ago. That will be 2016, I think. And uh, uh, first uh, it uh, worked with Razer Synapse 2.0, the old uh, Razer program. The mouse would appear here. But uh, recently it got removed from here and now it works only with uh, Razer Synapse 3.0. You can find this program by just uh, going on Google and searching for download Razer Synapse 3.0. Once you install the program you need either to create an account or log in uh, on your Razer uh, account and then when you plug the mouse you will see it here in the list like this and when you click on it you'll be able to set up pretty much everything uh, that can be changed about the mouse here we can see the buttons, you can reassign buttons, change the performance uh, by the way this is the, the stock default setting for uh, performance for this mouse DPI 180 uh, pulling rate uh, 1000 and from Windows it looks like this I've noticed that when you reinstall Windows uh, the, the settings will uh, change and the mouse will not feel uh, right so if you use these settings you will uh, have the mouse as as it was uh, before uh, just as new lightning this uh, mouse is uh, has chroma so you can uh, pick pretty much every color that you like calibration I also have a razor uh, mouse pad but you don't really need this I just use default no calibration and it works just fine so as I said uh, for this mouse you will need a Razer Synapse 3.0 because 2.0 is not uh, is not compatible anymore with this mouse even to its uh, it's not from the modern era for uh, the new modern Razer mice. Uh, it seems that it got integrated with 3.0. Okay, so this was the video. I hope that uh, you found it useful. If you did, please subscribe and thank you for watching.